being able to achieve things that others haven't seen and to do that quickly and to have results from that quickly uh, is, is the important thing. So Mathematica is a catalyst to the creativity, whereas all other forms of programming are hard work. My background has been across industry, finance, venture capital, and then uh, moved on to look at climate change. The global warming challenge and the adaption of economies to the new technologies emerging in the world. Um, understanding this is the biggest issue that all politicians uh, and in fact all citizens have. We need to understand the nexus between energy and population, uh, water uh, and between our economic activity. My modelling, which is composed of optimization and developing prices for all the commodities, um, is uh, solving the free market equations for the globe. I look at three major regions at the moment and interlinking by trade flows in each of the commodities and also interlinking specifically uh, to um, carbon dioxide because of the global warming, the overriding global warming um, um, feedback loops between um, what we produce and the damages that that causes through elevating atmospheric temperature and, and sea temperature. So uh, modelling all of that uh, is, um, uh, is a non-linear process which makes the modelling system infinitely more complex than if it was uh, a linear approach for just economics. So the climate adds this non-linear layer and makes it very uh, difficult to solve. The great success was managing to do this and uh, the power of Mathematica allowed me to do that. And without a model that takes into account free markets, uh, it's not possible to, to understand the dynamics of the situation. And so controlling commodities uh, through um, production of food, production of um, manufactured items, um, production of energy uh, through, uh, through understanding ratios and the technology functions involved um, allows me to be authoritative uh, across a lot of topics. And it's authoritative not in the sense of just understanding um, the, the, a one-off uh, set of factors that exist today, but it's understanding how these will play out against each other in the future. And uh, that's what's unique in, in getting these outputs from Mathematica in, in, the, in graphical form. I've presented to uh, a number of papers on this to international economists and uh, um, they as a, um, uh, as a group uh, are entranced by what they're seeing. They can see the dynamics of the markets working in front of them. It's a matter of keeping the data uh, as, as the uh, important feature and minimising the assumptions. If we can avoid putting um, unnecessary assumptions on the top of that data, then the results are due to the data, not due to the assumptions. And that's what this technique does, and why it's so dramatically different than um, existing uh, computable general equilibrium models. I went through many uh, different forms of software, and there was nothing that had the functionality and the uh, communications abilities, and just the sheer grunt that Mathematica has. The rapid um, development environment that Mathematica provides, the, the ability to, um, uh, to do things so concisely and so, so with so much power out of the functional programming and the pattern matching and all the things that um, are the great advantage of Mathematica, that, that allowed a very, very rapid development process. So in something um, a panels of experts were telling me would take a number of people a number of years, one person managed to do most of it in six months.